Okay, okay, part two. Enjoy my video. This is the intro now. Yeah. The new lord, the, the new lords also added a whole update where you can basically solo lord missions if you wanted to and if you could. So you know that. I'm gonna also show you this one, the uh, fragments of trivial fate. It's a pretty, it's a pretty fun one. Uh, again, I like the uh, other one a lot more. <laughs> the Corib uh, cabin. All right, let's give myself a boost. I think I linked to my pet, yes I did. All right, if you haven't done this one because you're like, I don't know if I want to do it, or you know, you failed somehow, or you know, your friends don't want to go with you and you didn't really get a chance to look at it yet, here it is. You search for the wrath by killing a wrath, well, yeah, wrath, wrath. Search for a wrath by killing all these monsters, uh, making your way through downtown and... <laughs> but yeah, yeah, no, no, no. You, you, you make your way through, you, you kill a bunch of monsters, and you, you gotta get to the ship. That's just the basics of it. And it's just straight down. You don't wanna go behind and somehow get lost. Unless that's what you're intending to do. Then get lost! Get lost to the... to your heart's content, people! It's a pretty cool mission too, but I, they, they, all of these give like cool enchants. Of course the drop rates are always a grind and it doesn't help that Lord missions are still three passes a day. But, you know, just put in the effort, hope you get lucky and who knows, maybe an event with increased drop rates for chests will happen again. It's always nice. Probably put down my volume for the background. I didn't. I didn't think it'd be this loud, to be honest. Uh, options, sound. At least it's loud for me. Uh, BG. Let's put that that low. That seems about right. Or is that too low? You know what? It's too low for me. I like. I, I kind of like the background. Farmer's tea. There we go. Maybe I will do this as a second video. You know what? I will. And then, cause, cause there's gonna be an update tomorrow. I, I recorded this on a Wednesday, so, you know. <laughs> Thursday maintenance days. You remember when the maintenance day was some, like a different day? I do. Try not to look back at Bobby's past, cause, you know, we're in the now. You wanna, you wanna live in the moment. Even though, you know, the, Irony is that it's an old game and it still has its old stuff. But I don't care. I still play it. I love it. Hello, pirates. I can't wait to get through the, uh, the raft. Because you get to fight on a boat. <laughs> Chains, you make my life easy, but I gotta grab Dorka. I don't have any of those Dorka snatching type of forges. I don't really... Or I guess Echo Stone, because I don't really buy... Forges. Not enough gold or money. And the vents don't pop them as much as they used to. Like that one treasure hunt event when you fought the goblins and jumped inside the. You, you are in Dumberton and the hidden treasure event. There we go. You're in Dumberton, you get the keys and you hope for the best and <laughs> you get like what, three tries? That was a fun event. Do you remember that event? By the way, comment down below. Let me know if you like that one too. That was one of my favorite ones. Mm. 
you just picture these skeletons getting uppercutted and just the head go flying when they just die. <laughs> just boom! There's the beach down there. Uh, wait, uh, come on camera. Okay, fine. Uh, the raft is down there. I wanted to show that. Show it earlier. You don't. You don't want to go to that beach over there with all the rocks. That's, that's not the right way. <laughs> I mean, unless you want to explore a bit, but what's the point? I mean, you do got enough time to do that anyway. Look at that. Time left: 54 minutes and 45 seconds. 30 seconds now. A narwhal! You watched him do that! You- oh. Oh, it has a little cutscene. How did I forget? But yeah, my narwhal just watched him hit me and it was like, okay, now that you're done getting hit, let's go ahead and do it himself. Oops. Uh-oh. It's okay. It's all good. We got this. That was more of a redirect as opposed to anything else. It's not like he's my saving grace. Let me dance to death. Yeah. This is the best dance. <laughs> this is the best dance there is. I call it... Uh, corpse Shuffle. You guys got a better name? Let me know. But yeah, when, you, when you're not moving, you just do the, the corpse shuffle. Uh, hopefully I'm not too loud when I upload this, actually. I'm gonna have to, like, double check that, too. All right, Narwhal, mossy boy, revive! He is back! All right, on the boat again! I, I, I want to say I found out, but it, it was a while ago that I found this out anyways. Like, a really long while ago. But the new Ego update, if, you, or that, if you're, you're a returning player, is the new Ego update. You're allowed to have three of them, but I was saying, what I found was cool is that when you get the Shitakin high enough, you can do an instant Sakura. It's amazing. When you mix it in with Time Shift, look at that. Sakura. It's like level 63, I believe, that will allow you to do that. As long as you, uh... Oh, the OST in here is cool. As long as you do the sub-quests, too. Oh, look! I can enter the cabin! I always wanted to know what was in here. Now I do! A hallway. At least this one is a hallway filled with monsters. Get out of here, monsters! Die already. Go, my my narwhal. Do your thing. And let me grab that Dorica. Oh, 
Oh, you see me like summoning extra pets and again for those new players or returning players or few about returning. What's this new thing from the pet uh what is it called? Pet tamer skill? Is it called? <laughs> it's in life skills now, but yeah yeah, I think it's a pet tamer skill. And you basically rank that up and you get a chance to, well not a chance, but you can unlock extra slots for your pet to summon extra, well, sub-pets, really. And it does their special effects, so that's pretty cool. Maybe if uh, someone asks to see that. video about that but and that, that's that's something fun to learn about. We'll see, we'll see. right, this video is not for kids. I said shit, and I said it again. Don't make me say it again, boys and girls. Oh, yeah, this is the boss. So, a good relink. That'd be nice. See? The ultimate boss. Black ship rat. Hit it! Run! No, pet! No! Run! Save yourself! Don't worry, pet- oh, there's the real boss, Admiral's Lingering Spirit. It's good to have a uh, Divine Link for this so that all these pets can come- I mean all the monsters can come after your pet, but the only other issue is he does have a desummoning thing, so when that happens, good luck. I mean, if you have techniques, even better, since you'll be able to, you know, Oops, he wasn't even near me. Since you'll be able to use Iron Will and... What's that stupid one called? Vital Surge. Oh, the stupid one's pretty good. But, while Iron Will is happening and you, you know... Oh, these things. You want to kill all these little balls as fast as you can. Because it will weaken him. And... Oh, this is where I need to use Iron Will and... Thing. It'll weaken him and give you a time to like spam him. And watch out for these little circles like most things in this stupid game. Cause it's a stupid game again, but you know, I love it. Mabby knows I love it! But since now is the face of Mabby, Mabby would be female, right? So she knows I love her. Come on out! Come on out! Is he actually stuck in there? Come on, boy! Try to finally hit you to death. <laughs> I just killed them all while they were ganging up on me. What is he doing? Oh shit, the balls. Come on, reach the next one. Oh no. I think I got it. Yeah, I did. I did. Where is he? It's right over here. Come on. Come on. There we go. Ah, uh, did that stupid thing get him my way? Come on. Let's get him. You know, if I went behind him and did that, it would probably work better. Kind of, right? Oh, you can put these monsters to sleep, by the way. That, that, that's pretty cool. It's not like other newer dungeons. Oop, get me out of there.
You know, I keep forgetting I have this stupid thing too. And it helps like push monsters back for a second. And I have this thing, Chaser. Does it let me use it on him? Yes it does. This is Stardust skills, by the way. The little pushback thing I was talking about and what you see dropping on him. True militian powers from the stars! I think that's the only reason why I like it. It's because it feels like it's it belongs in here. We are born from the stars and we use the stars. Come on, game. Let me see his dumb face. Let me see your dumb face. Stop trying to hide, ugly! <laughs> oh shit. Well, he's dead now. Look at that. Look at his dumb little face. Cool armor, though. I can't even see it. Wait, get that bar out of my face. There we go. Kind of see it there. The bar technically censored him. And then you get a pick from four chests, like the other Lord mission that I didn't mention, but you only get one key, unless event. Okay, let's open that up. Yes! Just what I wanted! A spinel! Okay, that was it. Thanks for watching my video. And until the next. Anyway, feel free to leave a comment down below. Leave a like. Share it with whoever, if, you know, whatever reason you want to share this video for. If you want to say to your friends, Hey, look, this guy did this thing, and now we can do it too. Or, hey, maybe we can do it better than him. This guy. That, that's supposed to be like a swear in between there. Anyway. Why do I have double glasses? What's, what's the point of this outfit if my glasses are going to be on my clothing and then on my head? Why, why do I need two? Okay, anyways, till the next!